Hello guys, my Habibi brothers. Hello. Today we're gonna watch the best lakes in the USA. Let's go, man. I love lakes, man. We found the city with lakes. Not city though. Uh, it's like town. Small. Yeah, this in Algeria. It's our dream now. Yeah. We wish to move there. Yeah. Inshallah. Yeah. It's and next, it's next to Tunisia. It's next to Tunisia. It's a beautiful place. It's Tunisia in English. Tunisia. Yeah. All right. Nothing compared to USA though. Yeah, it's not. It's not even close. Welcome to Mojo Travels, and today we're pondering what the best lakes for swimming are in the USA. Swimming! Are you a fan of our videos? Be sure to subscribe to Mojo Travels and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos. For this list, we're looking at lakes across America that are ideal for a dip, among other activities. Lake Santilla, North Carolina. In addition to its 76 mile shoreline, this lake is distinguished by the surrounding mountain Sweet. ranges. The Great Smoky Mountains rain up north, the Unicoin Mountains lie down west, and the Chio Mountains rest to the east. Heading about a mile away from the town of Lake Santilla, you'll find Chio Point Recreation Area. Under the US Forest Service's protection, this little piece of paradise has been carved out for camping, fishing, and of course, swimming. The soothing blue waters paired with the tranquil green backdrop. Oh, wow, house right there. Bruh, it's dream, so expensive. It's, dream. it's expensive as shit. I know. Make for one of the most relaxing swims in North Carolina. After drying off, why not? In Iceland, you can build anywhere. Anywhere. Nobody. Yeah. Does, yeah. No, yeah. no government. The government doesn't interfere. dictate yeah. where people should live. Yeah, yeah. But not, uh, true Islam, not, no, not, not countries not like these motherfuckers. Yeah. Yeah. Right now, it's so inflated, it's ridiculous. Inflated. Inflated? No, it's restricted. No, the prices. Yeah, the the land price is so inflated. And you can't just build. Yeah. You can't just like uh, ask for a land. They will never give it to you. You have to pay dearly. In in some like some city, if they like uh, the uh, the place, they they kick a lot of people. Yeah, yeah, out of their homes. It's rarely, but they do it. They do it. Yeah, yeah no paper, they don't give a shit. Follow up your swim with an atmospheric hike through the Joyce Kilmer Memorial Forest. Priest Lake, Idaho. One of Idaho's most charming tourist attractions, Priest Lake stretches 90 miles long and more than 300 miles deep. 300 miles from the US Canadian border is Priest Lake State Park. Located on the eastern coast, this park was made for swimming and much more. The lake Damn, also that... calls out to the lakes are big, man. What the hell? 300 miles deep. It's crazy. Deep? Like, uh, oh, what the f- Wow. <laughs> Oceans. <laughs> wow. <laughs> he surprised <laughs> me there. Look at I this. thought so too in the movie he said it. But this is too much. We don't have lakes like this. Look at this. Okay. Maybe like deep Africa. This is the life. Yeah, this is the best. Sky skiing? This is skiing? Water skiing? I don't know. Motorboats, kayaks, and paddleboards, guaranteeing a fun day on the water. The neighboring Selkirk Mountains yeah, yeah. will only the amplify water. your thirst to hit the lake. Yeah, yeah, After yeah. a stimulating water expedition, nothing is more satisfying than flopping the, down yeah. on the sandy shore and napping until the sun goes down. If you're up for a challenge, 54-year-old Ned Hastings swam from Upper Priest Lake's navigational campground to the Coolan Beach in 14 hours. Can you top that? Table Rock Lake, Missouri. The Ozarks have no shortage of alluring lakes, although Ozarks. few are as unique as Table Rock. This artificial lake derived from the Table Rock Dam, this which is artificial. What? was constructed in the 1950s to Ozarks have no shortage of alluring lakes, although few are as unique as Table Rock. This artificial lake derived from the Table yeah. Rock Dam, which was constructed okay. in the 1950s to manage floods on the White River, covering 43,100 oh. acres. Table Rock Lake extends into northwestern Arkansas, but it primarily attracts swimmers and campers from Branson, Missouri. For many Branson locals, the lake is only several minutes away. Who needs a pool when you have a lake practically in your backyard, right? While yes. visitors are treated to vibrant views above the surface, there's much to see below the water as well. Duck Island those? and Zebulon the pool when you have a lake. What is those floating? Uh, like a like a walk. Uh, what do they say? Walk. Uh, Lake practically in your backyard, right? While but visitors are treated to vibrant yes, views above the surface, the there's rain. much to see below the water as well. Yeah, you can Duck there. Island and Zebulon Pike are among the most fascinating scuba diving locations with sea life and sunken boats waiting to be discovered. Sunken Lake Martin, boats. Alabama. Cool. 
Lake Martin also formed thanks to a dam's construction. When it came into being during the 1920s, Martin was the largest artificial lake on the planet. Although that record has since been surpassed, it's still the biggest it's lake hot. of its kind in Alabama, covering more than 40,000 acres. As such, there's plenty of water for swimming, boating, and paddling. The lake encompasses several islands tailor-made for adventure. Acapulco Rock Island by Tallapoosa River Looks Gorge like may be the most yeah. thrilling spot with cliff exactly. divers plunging into the waters below. While Lake Martin has a Sweet. wide variety of sea life, it's most notably home to several eagle nests. It doesn't get more majestic than seeing an eagle land by the dock as you float in the water. Flathead Lake, Montana. Eagles can attack people now. I don't know. They are huge, no? You are not allowed to touch them, like uh, hunt them. Yeah, especially in USA. Yeah, in the USA. I'm not... You won't find a larger natural lake in northwest oh, Montana no. than Flathead. In, in terms of surface area, it's also the biggest freshwater lake west of the Mississippi River. Flathead's legacy is tied to Lake Missoula, a prehistoric body of water formed towards the end of the Ice Age. A product of this proglacial wow. lake, we wouldn't advise swimming in Flathead during the winter. Between June and August, though, there isn't a better place for locals and tourists to cool off. Wild Horse Island is not only a splendid spot for swimming, but also for observing wildlife like birds, bighorn sheep, and more eagles. It's a sheep. Speaking of wildlife, legend yes. claims that a monster oh, lurks in Flathead Lake. For venturesome swimmers, yeah. though, that should only heighten your curiosity. Colors. Lake George, Vibrating. New York. When people think about bodies York, of water too. in New York, the Hudson <laughs> River usually comes to mind. While the Hudson is great for observation, we'd suggest visiting Lake George to get your laps in. Lake George possesses an old-fashioned sentiment that'll take you back to a simpler time, whether you're lying on your back in the water or looking out from aboard a steamboat. There are several sandy locales where the whole family can frolic, including Shepherd's Park Beach, Dog Beach and Million Dollar Beach. beach. Don't worry, that last one won't cost you a fortune, although <laughs> the scenery is priceless. Of course, if you do have some cash to burn, the Sagamore Resort provides wow. one of the most polished waterside views in the Northeast. What is that hotel? Lake Erie, Ohio. The first of the North American Erie. Great Lakes to appear on this list, Erie also touches upon Michigan, Pennsylvania, and New York, not to mention Ontario. Too, wow. As far as swimming goes, however, we'd argue that what Ohio that captures color? Lake Erie at its From most Ohio nuance. New There's a section of the lake that can appeal to everyone. Kelly's Island will bring out your inner explorer, while also providing a laid-back ambience. Port Clinton has been called the walleye capital of the world, in case you want to get some- It doesn't look like a lake at all. You think it's the ocean. Yeah, waves ocean. too. Of course there is waves. But uh, you think this is the ocean? Of course there is waves. Yeah, it's a big, large of uh, water. Okay. Yeah. Fishing in with your swim. The Battle of Lake Erie took place near Putin Bay, a nostalgic village that treats tourists like family. The highlight is arguably the mile-long White Sand Beach alongside Cedar Point Amusement Park. Lake Powell, Arizona Living in Arizona, you need a refreshing spot to escape the heat. While the extreme weather can be more than some can handle, it does have its advantages. We don't know about you, but few things are more unnerving than jumping into a freezing lake. You are unlikely to have this problem, however, with Lake Powell. The water is at its warmest during July with an average temperature of 85 degrees Fahrenheit. This is when swimmers venture to the chains at the Glen Canyon National Recreation Area. The temperature is complemented by the natural scenery, which possesses the splendor of a perpetual sunset. When temperatures drop to 41 degrees Fahrenheit in January, trade in That's your kayak for hiking boots and see the other wonders Lake Powell has to offer. It's too cold. Lake Michigan, Wisconsin. The largest body of water yeah. on our list, Lake Michigan so has a Look few states three, in common, yeah. including Illinois, Indiana, and, well, Michigan. You can smell it. <laughs> Wisconsin is cold during the winter. I remember a lot of snow. Well, yeah. You see the green. It's a hint. I remember this. Uh, it's a uh, cheese state, I think. So, yeah. <laughs> cheese? Yeah. Okay, I think Although so. those three also have prime swimming spots, Lake Michigan has perhaps done the most for Wisconsin's tourism, particularly Door Country. As a matter of fact, one of Door Country's most notable residents was Catherine Whitney Curtis, who pioneered synchronized swimming. So, clearly something in those Wisconsin waters inspired her. Lake Michigan has certainly inspired us with remote areas like Karna Island, providing the perfect backdrop for reflection. Lake Michigan has certainly inspired us with remote areas like Canna Island, it's providing the perfect on, backdrop man. for reflection. Yeah, the better. Green Bay shoreline also offers a wide assortment of peaceful swimming spots with green treetops and crystal waters awesome. for miles. Just remember to wait an hour before swimming and eating that famous Wisconsin cheese. Crater Lake, 
Oregon. You're right. Unlike all other. Oh, what? Cheese. Yes. Oh, I don't know. I remember. Imagine this here, man. I'm here. Just, uh, like it's his legs in this uh, life. I'm uh. thinking like paradise. How paradise is going to be like? Yeah, this is going to be ridiculous. This is looking all paradise on earth. The prophet said nothing in compares no, to it. No, no eyes seen, no eye. No, no ear has heard it. And no eyes no. seen it. Can it saw it. I'm terrible at this. <laughs> this is like, you butchered it. You butchered it. No eyes have ever saw it. Yeah. No ears have ever heard it. And you no can, mind has ever dreamt of it. Like, not dreamt, like, imagine it. Yeah, you cannot even imagine this it. This is a rough, rough translation. <laughs> Don't quote me on this. Entries, there's only one place at Crater Lake where you can legally and safely swim. Cleetwood Cove Trail. There's also a limited time to visit, as Cleetwood is typically only open from mid-June to late October. While that's not especially convenient, Crater Lake is like an exclusive five-star restaurant. Getting a reservation may take some patience and perseverance, but once you sink your teeth wow. into the food, it's all worth it. Likewise, Crater Lake rewards... Is there a reservation for who? From the city? What? Yeah. Okay. It's this closed. Says ...with drop-dead gorgeous panoramic views of the deep okay. blue water this and surrounding color. hill. Sure, you can wow. observe this from a hiking trail, but looking out from water is an experience that can't be topped. It's the most personal view that Crater Lake has to offer. Do you agree with our picks? Less one is crazy. The color. No, the, the one before less is better. Wisconsin. Yeah. Yeah. The Ohio one is unique too. They are beautiful. They are good. Anyway, I, I'll go there. <laughs> In a second. Gladly. Heart Gladly. <laughs> yeah. I'll live there. If I give, Ours don't given the chance. Man. Ours don't even compare to this. Yeah, yeah. The city we're talking about. It's so small. Yeah, its name is Kala if you want to look it up. No, Kala. The... Algeria Kala. Yeah, it's Kala. Mm. K A L A. L A. Beautiful, Algeria. but not, not this. Big. It has three, three, three legs, but small legs. legs. Not like this. If you if you combine them all, they will not they will not like fulfill one of these. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's too that's cool. all we got. <laughs> yes, that's all we got. Okay, guys, really enjoy this video. Yeah, Make sure yeah. to like and subscribe, and see you guys in the next one. See you.